Hi everyone, this is Stefano from Osteocom, and I'd like to show you what's hot on Osteocom for this week. Uh, let's start with the login in order to see the most watched video of the week. Uh, of course, here you have to enter your email address, your password, and then click on login in order to get inside Osteocom.me. The most watched video of the week comes from our latest channel, which is Digital Rehabilitation by Dr. Ciabattoni and Apicella. Uh, I leave to you, uh, you know, finding out, discovering all the details of this course, which focuses on uh, immediate restorations uh, with a very, uh, very cutting edge approach uh, that comprises a prefabricated prosthesis in order to develop a fully digital workflow. And uh, well, the most much video is the second one which is immediate full arch restoration of completely identical maxilla with prefabricated implant supported prosthesis. By clicking on the video, you will find, you know, a brief description of the surgery that is portrayed here. And well, let's get to the video. Let's see it together. Very nice angle at the beginning. Welcome everybody. Uh on digital rehabilitation channel, we will see together the immediate restoration in pre with primitive prosthesis in the dentulous maxillary case. This is the X-ray, but we go immediately to the 3D planning. This is the matching of the radiological guide, thanks to the double scanning technique with the bone. You see all the two image, the red denture with good aperture marker inside. And thanks to the double scanning technique, we can easily remove. I think it is great. Uh, at the very beginning of the video, you have a very thorough description of all the pre-surgical phases that allow the authors to come up with a prefabricated prosthesis that somehow works as guide for the complete workflow of the surgery. Uh, well, let's see something more. Skip it couple of minutes. As you can see, it's pretty detailed. Find the best position solving the conflicts between the pin. Here we have the description of the, of the position of the pins, implants, both and this palatal side like and uh, the the stibular side. side. You see the conflicts with the, this pin with the implant itself, and also the pin became orange, but a little bit adjustment and we solved any conflicts and so, the plan is already made. I mean, look at it. This is great. Uh, during the description, the authors are able to identify the potential um, misplacement of the pins, both palatal side and vestibular side, and, you know, come up with a very, very, very detailed um, description of the positioning of the six implants that will represent the core of the rehabilitation. See all the parallelism, some little adjustment for the parallel pin, but we love to have all the implants parallel to each other to allow us to better placing the pre-made processes at the very end of the surgery. That's huge. Uh, the pre-made surgery is really available. I mean, the definitive fixed prosthesis is really available at the very end of the surgery. And it represents the true innovation that this video aims to, aims to, to, to communicate, to show. Plus here we're talking about a pretty complex rehabilitation. I mean, it is a completely identical maxilla uh, this treated with six parallel implants. Actually, we are talking about noble biochar implants, by the way. I think it is pretty easy to, to, to observe this in the uh, preliminary analysis that is provided by the authors. And the description of the pre surgical um, evaluations and, and phases are then um, completed by a very detailed surgical representation. So, we can have now to close the mouth of the patient and now 
is the moment, the key point, there is my... The position of the penis according to what we saw during the pre-surgery pre evaluation. Very, very firm. The fitting of, of the guide is incredible. 1.5 millimeter grid for the anchor pin. You can avoid, it's mandatory to avoid any movement in this part of the surgery. And this is the fixation of the buckle pin. Okay. Here okay. they are. Stop. The very first phase of the surgery, right after the preparation of the soft tissue, which is described a couple of minutes before this moment. Let's go. Oh, well, let's keep. Yeah, let's keep a few minutes and see. Yeah, some implant placement. I think this is interesting. Action. I want to show you the, the hand of Jean Pierre. When you are fully guided, you can leave the hand from the, end, the device. Wow. You are fully guided and let you drive from the system. Don't <laughs> use not so much force in this kind of thing. This is incredible. I mean, the guide is kind of doing all the job. Uh, this really stressed the importance of a very precise and correct pre-surgical evaluation and planning, digital planning of the whole, uh, of the whole surgery. This really saves a lot of time and you know, allows to avoid most pitfalls in implant rehabilitation. Let's see something, um, let's see some, something more about this approach, which is, as you can see, completely flapless. Okay. And here it is, the pre-made prosthesis. You see the prosthesis now, and now we are pushing to fitting. There is some possibility to engage the prosthesis. There is a metal soldered bar inside. You know, you have a rigid system now. So we approach with the finger, we press a little bit to force the releasancy of the to check. And we try by manual. This is a manual control. Screwdriver. Uh, if you are able to engage some screw. Of we see some engagement. Then if you feel some manual engagement with the manual screwdriver, It's the first good sensation. The fitting is perfect. I mean, wow. You can press a little bit because we have to force. Some, sometime we have some <laughs> resiliences of the mucosa. <laughs> then, after checking by manual sensation, we change with it with the motor device. We use the screwdriver. Of course. Now it's switching to a uh, motor power screwdriver. And let's see. To move the patient, maybe. I have to show you better the occlusal result at the first sensation. Because now we are approaching to the next step. There is the radiographic confirmation of the fitting of this prosthesis onto the implant. This is exactly what they wanted to show you. Tightening. After the control of this fitting by X-ray, we can Let's see okay. the X-ray. And you see the occlusion of the patient. And this is a very, very good result because it is. we have a very good sensation of the Sorry, I was laughing with jump here because it's a very, very good sensation. Then we have, we have to jump to, to look at the X-ray. This is the pre-surgery pre X-ray. <clears throat> and this is high happy patient. Uh, it doesn't surprise me much that this was the most watched video of the week. 
Um, I think it is great to uh, be able to provide to an international community this kind of educational content and take home so many tips and tricks concerning implant supported restoration with this kind of approach. So I look forward to meet you all again for in the upcoming weeks in order to see together what's up on Astiacom and new, re new releases, new videos, and I also look forward to your comments uh, concerning what we are doing here. Bye-bye.